Namaskaram. Good evening to you all. Let me first invite the guest of the evening. Let me see. I welcome you all to the live series and the live interaction on Instagram. And this is my first interview series where uh, I will be interviewing non musician uh, interaction on music. So, let me first introduce the artist which I call usually. The featuring today is Srimati Sangeeta ji from Think Smart. Let me first pull her so that if she is there, let me invite her first and add yeah. so i have i have namaste sangeeta ji namaste mayesh ji yes uh, i'm so happy to start this interview series today um as the topic says lockdown interview series by mahesh vinayakaram uh, a musician interviewing non musician about the music so i've always been uh, thinking about creativity and so today series in today first series i'm so happy to introduce shrimati sangeeta ji from their brand called think smart she's an entrepreneur for almost one decade 10 years and more and she's been uh, uh, mastering in her field of project coordination let's say logo creation and she knows a deep knowledge on typography and time management advertising facilitation corporate branding client communication and much more which is completely not my subject but i try to find a, a relevance and also the bridge that's the idea of today and also this series is about so i welcome you all and i'm going to start with an invocation so that we can the questions and also we'll have a q and a session with the today's feature so let me go on and i'm going to sing an invocation on lord ganesha so let's start vakratunda mahakaya surya koti Surya Koti Samaprabha Nirviknam Kurume Devo Sarvakareshu Sarvada Aye Thank you. Sangeeta ji, we welcome you Namaste. all. Namaste. Please uh, go for it. Please introduce yourself and so that all our friends can get to know exactly what is your field is all about. Yeah, uh, I'm Sangeeta. I am a graphic designer basically. Uh, my company's name is Think Smart Branding. Uh, so we do all types of branding work, designing work and printing uh, works also. Uh, so I'm into this business for more than, as you said, more than 11 years. Uh, so I'm uh, designing for many events, uh, uh, specifically many musical events uh, for Vikram Vinayakram Ji and uh, all your uh, musicians. I'm uh, doing a lot of designing works. And for London, Tyagaraja Aradhana also, I'm designing for uh, seven, uh, eight years, for more than eight years. And for Radha Kalyanam in uh, uh, New Jersey, I'm... Uh, uh, designing for them also. Uh, then I have many clients in Switzerland and USA, dance teachers. So for dance, Arangetrams, I, uh, I design for them also. Basically, uh, uh, for traditional designs, I like to do traditional designs. Uh, so I, uh, my clients are also same. So I am associated with Nandalala Seva Samiti Trust, Mailapo. I am a volunteer in it. So I have uh, done a lot of designing work for them and I have coordinated a lot of uh, events for them actually with musicians. So we do a lot of uh, uh, fundraising programs for our medical foundation. So mm -hmm. I have coordinated with uh, uh, 
विक्यू नायक राम जी जम शिवम मनी सर देन अरुणा शाय राम जी सो आई हैव कॉर्डिनेट विथ लॉट ऑफ थिंग सो एंड आई डू फॉर डिजाइनिंग फॉर कॉर्पोरेट्स ऑल्सो सो कॉर्पोरेट्स नीडिंग ऑल द थिंग्स लाइक स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द लोगो टिल द वॉल ब्रांडिंग सो आई डू एवरीथिंग एंड आई टेक केयर ऑफ द एग्जीक्यूशन पार्ट ऑल्सो सो गोइंग ऑन गुड एंड इन दिस टाइम मेनी पीपल और interested in projecting their business online digital in digital yes. media so i am doing lot of digital designs now so as you say that that's a good introduction so people get to know and uh, to know that now it's going to be 2020 where digital media so everything is happening in the digital and also uh, especially on this lockdown series please idea behind this series is that we can bring the creativity of a uh, non musician for example my concept is to prove and also to let the people know that the idea of the brain i always been saying this fact whenever i talk i always say about uh, the left side brain and the right side brain which works left is all uh, survival and right side which is connected to the heart chakra so the first question to you sangeeta ji would be like um, what what is the passion like what is the difference of you being doing what you like and also that the connectivity and also the connection of today's uh, topic where like creativity so for you in your journey in your perception in your perspective uh, how does the creativity plays role in your work and also can be in your lifestyle of your work so for example if you ask me what is your perspective it's all about music and i can say something about it. the same way inspiration and it can be anything so the first question for you is that what is creativity for you in your perception uh, actually i should share the, this experience of mine uh, but before 11 years i was just a housewife and uh, uh, i i don't know what is happening outside the world other than the house so once i went to a dtp center to design a invitation for our trust so mm-hmm. i saw that boy was playing with photoshop he was ah. doing such a great thing uh, we were just giving the ideas and he he was making it happen so it was mm-hmm. very nice to see and uh, uh, at that point uh, it triggered to me so this is my field so i should take this as my uh, profession so beautiful sorry to stop you there <laughs> it's beautiful so now uh, listeners you can just listen to this particular point because i i'm sorry to stop that before i forget as she says that she has recognized herself saying that this is my stuff so this is the point i wanted to tell you all that you have to find your creativity so she has found that this is my uh, yukti this is my vision that i wanted to continue sorry yeah please continue for it so i just stay went straight to my guru uh, pooja shri matiyali saraswati amma is my guru guru okay. i i went to her and uh, i expressed my uh, thing that i should learn uh, graphic designing so so basically uh, said, the graphic okay, go, designing okay. okay yeah graphic designing so she uh, she uh, she asked me to go for a class for 6 months so i went mm-hmm. for a class uh, so i finished it and started a small company vriksha design and mm-hmm. it went on very well and in between i started one recording studio also okay. uh, there was a tipping point for that also actually my guru gave me a chance to do a video presentation for her 70th birthday okay so her 70th birthday was a year long celebration and she requested me to do a video presentation for the grand, uh, grand finale and mm-hmm. i i was not aware of any of the editing softwares or the music editing softwares nothing i haven't been to any studio also till then okay. so I, i learned myself from the internet i downloaded many softwares i tried one by one and i did a presentation with voice over with music mixing everything triggering Good. point for me to start uh, editing and a record studio so vriksha vriksha uh, i mean uh, vamsi melodics was the studio i was running it for 2 years and then wow. uh, it did not work out properly so i just closed it and took full mm-hmm. uh, time as graphic designer mm-hmm. the i always tell this one uh, actually if you take your profession wo- the passion as your profession that then it will not be a burden for you to work Very so true. i took passion as my profession and it has never been a burden mm-hmm. for me 
that i will spend 24 by 7 before my system wow. actually my laptop is my friend so i <laughs> talk good. to my laptop i express everything to my laptop so Beautiful. it's like that so designing like is my passion like how we have uh, instruments as our friends Uh, your friend would be your laptop and uh, yes yeah. and mobile phone now <laughs> because lot of uh, software have come in mobile also right so true uh, apps and all so so that's a that's a beautiful like that. answer and uh, i see that all the people have been also giving comments and you can also comment us to know whether the audibility is good and uh, if any questions pops up i can also note it down and ask uh, sangeeta ji parallelly and today i have it's a very new thing that i'm having a textbook and a pen instead of my morsing and other musical instruments of course i have other instruments in between i'll be playing down but what the idea is to share to the people is that the creativity lies in every concept and every uh, field of work whether it is a graphic designing or anything it needs a tempo it needs a musicality it needs a voice over it it has both melody and the rhythm like how you say tuk tuk lap tap lap tap lap tap tak 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 din din tak 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 din din da to lap tap so everything goes on a rhythm let it be 1 to 9 i can tell you later but the idea is to find the unison between all the people in this lockdown that's why i started doing this series so that it can bridge all the people and come together to create a positive approach in your life especially in this pandemic situation so other than the music there are also possibilities that we could do thanks for answering that and uh, in this video would you like to give us some tips about uh, anything which is related to your graphics or any apps that we could take a note or any uh, small tip would you like to share with us how you edit a photo starting from uh, uploading a picture on the youtube or uh, in any social media instead of just dragging drop you can do it as a nice poster so that you can put a poster and like however i mean you might know much better than that so can you suggest us some number of apps and would you like to share something from your side that we can take home back after the session yeah there are two or three apps which are really very good uh, okay. uh, actually we can use it in our mobiles one of them is canva can you spell that please c a n v a canva okay what app is that uh, it is an editing software uh, you have lot of uh, uh, ready made templates in it you okay. have animated animated templates and uh, 2d templates also Mm -hmm. so you can you make use of them you can change the picture in it if you want to post it post it in instagram you will be having a separate set of uh, templates Beautiful. and if you are going to use it for a facebook you will be having a separate set of uh, uh, templates like that we will have and a uh, uh, lot of quotes also are there so you can search for whatever you want you can search and take for uh, uh, for example if you want to make a wish for diwali so mm -hmm. if you type uh, go and uh, search for diwali wishes you will have lot of templates in that mm -hmm. so you can you can replace uh, some other picture also and you can replace the quotes text and all everything you can do in that so it is very nice actually uh, beautiful my uh, usually i don't find the time to promote my brand okay uh, i always working on the system but i will not find time to make a design for my own brand so mm -hmm. while traveling while traveling uh, i use this app and uh, uh, i create my uh, uh, promotion material that's that amazing <laughs> so you do your own stuff only during travel so it's so yes. you mean to say that it's so accessible that these apps are so accessible by anybody so that it can e yeah. even a starters can easily access yeah starters also can uh, easily access and there is another app also pixart P I C S A R T Pixart. Okay. What is this? So it is, is also about? it is also as editing software uh, mm -hmm. where you can edit pictures. You can uh, lot of filters are there in the picture. So uh, mm -hmm. some pictures will be blurred or it will be too I mean uh, flashy or something like that. So you can use mm -hmm. those apps. You can just uh, do color correction also, and uh, you can mask the picture if you mm -hmm. want to. 
for instagram post and all it, it need to be a square post okay uh, for facebook uh, it can be a portrait so it's all so, depends on the vertical and depends. the horizontal yeah everything is there yeah for if you if you want to post it in a youtube uh, if you want to do a slide for a youtube thing you will be having a uh, i mean the horizontal template everything mm-hmm. is there okay so you can make use of them so it That's is amazing. very easy it's very Beautiful. easy to yeah it is very easy to use also amazing and would you like to show us some uh, quick uh, introduction or anything like a uh, how to edit uh, uh, you know like a quick uh, learning of anything what what uh, i can like to... i can i just narrate i can narrate okay. uh, if you go to the pixart uh, app inside inside the app you can you need to download it from the uh, play store and if oh, you sure. just after entering it into it you will see a plus uh, sign at mm. the bottom of the screen you should just press the plus sign and you will see your gallery pictures there okay so uh, if you want to do something uh, new you can download some picture from the internet and keep it ready already so okay. you can choose that picture and mm-hmm. you can fit it into a square thing mm. square thing and uh, there will be a text tool there you can take uh, just click on it and mm. you can type whatever you want you can tilt the uh, uh, text like this this everything you can do and you mm. can change the color of the text you can give a shadow to the text you can add a stroke to this text everything you can do so it is that's really amazing. very easy it is very really that's very easy that's a great easy. demo yeah that's a good and uh, uh, by using these apps you can do and uh, and also you said that you are going to teach and how can the people uh, get in touch with you do you have a email or how do how do they get in touch uh, can you give me some of your uh, you can text later maybe or in the yeah. comment box you can give us so that i can also try to text it like uh, yeah i have my website Mhm. Think smart branding. Yeah, so com. your uh, thing is called Think Smart Branding and Brand, people can yeah. catch you and then if they want to know some stuff they can approach you on the email and things like that. So I usually uh, I, I mean moving to the next one I always have this one the idea of today series is all about like uh, lockdown tips. So yeah. <laughs> as you know that now it's a pandemic situation that we have to be in the home. and uh, if you ask me the uh, lockdown tips i have a series of tips which i have been doing for example you can sit in the home try to do your sadhana in the morning and you spend some time for yourself so speaking about me if you ask me the uh, tips for the uh, you know in this lockdown you can you can part your timings accordingly starting from morning you can start your yoga you can start your music and then you can spend some time for learning so there are things on the online you can learn and then you can start revealing your other uh, you know expertise like let it be kitchen cooking or cleaning it can also be i love cleaning because i'm more into the cleaning like i help my mom <laughs> since my small i have uh, and also me and my all my brothers we used to travel a lot in extensively so during that staying in a big apartment i would always take the uh, things of housekeeping would be my let's say i oh, love doing nice. housekeeping i always <laughs> keep my stuff so uh, clean because we can live a kingdoms and we can li- live a king's life on our own just keeping ourselves so neat and then keeping the things on time and then a small diva and a small music changes the environment so that it brings a different pattern on the uh, brain pattern so the same way what would you, what would be your uh, lockdown tips for people uh, like uh, creative people like you what would be your is please let us know actually i would say life uh, in uh, lockdown is very disciplined than the usual life so uh, i'm getting up early in the morning i'm going for a walk daily inside the compound okay. so one mm-hmm. hour i walk daily one hour and then i do workouts for 20 minutes and mm-hmm. then i start my day uh, i have started uh, sundarakanda parayanam uh, so i'm doing it uh, for the past one month and uh, then after the breakfast i will come and sit in my system uh, i'm very lucky to have my mom with me so she takes care of the uh, cooking everything she doesn't <laughs> disturb me at all moms are so, amazing 
<laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> so uh, I just come and sit before my system, and mm-hmm. I'm a uh, lot of references, and I'm updating myself in uh, whatever ways possible, and I am trying to do uh, try lot of tutorials. I download lot lot of tutorials and try them. So I am just updating myself in my uh, field, and mm. I am also uh, I have joined a digital marketing course now. Mm. So in my field, digital marketing is going to be the future. So mm. I just wanted to make myself uh, updated in that also. So I am just uh, I have taken up the uh, digital marketing classes. So uh, then evening seven to eight, uh, I take uh, classes, Photoshop classes, online Photoshop classes. Beautiful. So that's also going on work. Uh, so. So going That's on amazing. Good. So whole of the schedules become so disciplined that you can you yes. can really you know devote so much of time. And for me, in my perception, I would also say that I want to do something inside. Like whatever we try to do outside, I would do inside. For example, the inner engineering. The whatever you said, the same discipline. My medium is music. So the same way, I would try to take the music into the next level. of uh, achieving different uh, kinds of music learning process and uh, and also i would try to reveal other perspective for example if i want to learn a guitar or if i want um, uh, to to notate a thing i'll start working on that and then you can part down exactly all the hours together and then you can relax and also you can uh, completely out of box thinking you can start thinking and uh, try to uh, go much of uh, other ideas so in that way, uh, the creation and the animation and the artistic brain let it be anything starting from kolam rangoli or uh, uh, starting from sketching starting from mandala or anything which related to the brain of the left and the balance of right would be so interesting for me so that's why i started learning so much of instrument though i am a melody expression i always have this Uh, rhythm instinct on me it's a genetical so i've always been collecting instrument so to start with i would like to give you a little bit of um, glimpse of instruments that i collect so i would like to play you first instrument morsing morsing has a big history it is called morsing in south and it's called morchang in north indian yeah? and it's called jewish harp and it has a big festival in europe about this and let me show you this instrument If you see the science behind this instrument, it's just a tiny instrument. Thank you. It's just in between the teeth, and you hardly get any sound. Oh. Just with oh, the oh. moment of the in between, and then the air which goes upwards and the downwards, and then you say the bowls, which is called the scat singing, the kono kol, on the half sound. Takadimi takajuno takadina tam. Takadina takadina takadindi datum. उंडे so that's the one of the yeah, instruments which i can thank you come back to and uh, about the creativity i always uh, have this aspect and also this concept which is going on so it's not only the musicians the mu- the dancers or the theater uh, actors it's just the creativity is everywhere in every means of our life uh, starting in kitchen 
if you are a chef you start co- collaborating and you start expressive on the, on your own ideas like for example you have a korumbu the the sambar and which is leftover sambar added with the yogurt becomes more korumbu yeah further <laughs> it's the but ingredients are the same so same. <laughs> it, it's just means are the different the same way you know falafel is chapati and the falafel roll is chapati for us that's called falafel hummus is chutney for us hummus is just a peanut chutney but hummus with falafel that becomes like a chutney and uh, the same way the inspiration and uh, uh, the inspiration people inspire people so in that way the next question following the graphics one what is your inspiration who is uh, your inspiration and uh, what would be your inspiration for your input to devote your quality time on your work what would be your inspiration actually my guru is my inspiration see uh, she encouraged me a lot and uh, uh, she is the reason that time like this now so i have okay. started It's my own company guru? Uh, yeah. spiritual guru my spiritual guru my spiritual oh. guru madhyali saraswati amma and then uh, uh, actually uh, i have one friend mr mohammed yusuf uh, he only initiated me to start the company i was a freelancer designing designer actually so he initiated me to start this uh, think smart branding he named the company and he sat with me and designed the logo for me and he made me start this company so he is an inspiration to me okay. so uh he is my best friend and i am having my office in his place only he has given me a space in his office and i am having the office there in ashoknagar and uh, who else and my family my my daughter my son in law and my Beautiful. son uh, everybody my mom my sister everybody encourages me a lot in this so uh, if i have small thing also they will sh- uh, if i do small things in the designing also they is something different also they used to encourage me mummy this is very super you do it so my daughter takes care of the insta page of mine so mm. she does everything for me so like that so uh, everybody i meet they inspire some something or the i i, sh- I see very good things only in person so beautiful the positivity I, i i we really appreciate your positive approach to the lifestyle and that is really important what this idea is again 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 i'm trying to repeat the same is that i wanted to bring out the positive approach in this pandemic situation saying the message that we can bring that positivity within us the battery in us which we calibrate and also we generate that so we have the power of generating that positivity it's only that we left to light it ignite in a n- nicer way so we get inspiration and uh, also can you let us know something about uh, a little more on the editing part what you were just discussing and uh, can you give me some light about a uh, general idea of editing in a software or editing in a, a phone or editing a small uh, picture for a facebook and socializing social media you have any tips on the in for uh, social media editing so, tips uh, editing tips you should choose the correct picture actually first thing is yes. that you should choose okay. the correct picture uh, it should not be blur or it should not no disturbance should be there in the picture so it should okay. be a clear one you should take the picture and you can add filters to it so mm-hmm. that uh, the colors will change right so you can mm-hmm. have a sepia effect you can have okay. a, a tone color tone effect something like that so it will be very can appealing can you suggest us some kind of uh, uh, resolution the basic resolution that people basic, who post uh, everything yeah okay. uh, you should go to google images and search for large images large images large large images so uh, large images will be the clarity will be very good actually Mm-hmm. so if you take the uh, pixels very less than 500 uh, pixels and all it won't be clear at all so mm-hmm. above 500 1000 uh, it will be very clear so mm-hmm. this is one tip you can uh, take pictures like that from internet sure. and you can use mm-hmm. them okay and you should for a design you should use very less text and the picture is should, pictures should be less six text and uh, picture should be bright and prominent mm-hmm. so it will be very appealing yes less text and more of the image 
and and the, on image, the color yeah. wise it's a important one so can you give us some light on how to choose the colors and it all reflects on so for different things but for you to appeal anything i would i would really give that credit and uh, all my dear friends you should all know that sangeeta ji is one who has been doing this particular poster and all my other posters for our family entirely if you could have seen um, we have been hosting a con in chennai in triplicen uh, it's called uh, tiruvida ves sangeeta utsav was completely going on and all these eight years she has been designing the she has been designing all the invitations which has a very ethnic look so people really uh, you know uh, they just find it exactly with the font even with the font and also with the uh, kind of uh, you know the outlay they would easily relate that it is a sangeetam it's related to the music so the inlay and design is very important as a musical perspective i would say even as a musician uh, just for posting i think the colors and even the all other things are very important so and also i find that that artistic approach for uh, creative brains always there so i am very happy to say that she is the one uh, who has should, done uh, that i should mention one thing in this actually i am very thankful to mr uma shankar because uh, uh, in 2013 i was facing a very bad situation and uh, he just came to my office i was having the recording studio he just came to my office with uh, mr raja raman uh, he just gave the full work of samarpan 2013 to me Amazing. the samarpan series uh, we are doing yes. in the uh, year or uh, year i right so he gave the designing work to me and it helps so much for me to come out of all my uh, uh, this thing amazing it's all god's wish I that it just came down in my life yeah. <laughs> amazing and also so, i request all all my friends who are there thanks for coming i mean be, uh, before we end there is a 5 minutes time like you would like to ask any question related to today about the editing and about anything which is related to the uh, uh, topic you can please pop up the questions if you do have or else i would like to really thank uh, all the uh, friends who have come and uh, mostly all my very good friends have come i am so thankful that uh, a big artist from uk mr pete lockett who is an established artist a british artist who has been inspiring and who has inspired by indian music and taken the indian music into a global platform so like those i'm so happy that they are just watching this is the new series um, uh, interview of musician with non musician to uh, to bridge the creativity so today i'm so happy that nidha ji has come from her uh, think smart and we are talking branding. about branding and we are talking about so much of graphics so before we wind if any questions you have please let us know or uh, i would just lead it to sangeeta ji for any more tips or any more apps you have or before we wind would you like to say something yeah a lot of my friends have also joined uh, here uh, they are watching they are just yes. commenting <laughs> so <laughs> thanks for <laughs> thanks all of you for coming and watching me so it is a nice experience uh, mahesh ji to be with you so please thank you so much so. for revealing all those uh, nice uh, things which were relating to the artistic brain which is creative brain so i always say this so each of the session i would like to show you some of my toys for boys so i can show you the quickly i can show you the toys as i said this is morsing and this is another morsing uh which is european one juice heart the lower register and also the very lower one and then i have an interesting instrument which is called kalimba kalimba is an instrument from african origin and it has a beautiful strings and uh, hokema is one of the brand which produces this and it has very tone just let let me give you an um, sound of this mm. 
Sambakam Yajamade Sugantim Pushti Vardanam Urvaru Kaviva Vandanam Mrityur Mukshi Yavamrita Om Shanti Thank you so much for supporting. Thank you. And as I said before, I keep repeating this is an initiative uh, that I just wanted to take it to bring, bridge between all the artistic brain. Let it be singers, let it be dancers, let it be percussive people or any people who is related to artistic brain. So these are possibilities that we can sit in the home to produce that positive approach in this pandemic situation that we can unite together to be there in the home. So stay home, stay safe. Thank you, Sangeeta Ji, for coming. Uh, in Thank the you, Mahesh Ji, for the opportunity. Thank you so much. See you. Thank you. See Very you good initiative. In people oh, thank you so much. Yeah, <laughs> and thank you for the poster design. And it's specially designed <laughs> by everybody. I mean, all, all the other designs were de designed by uh, Sangeeta Madam. So uh, special thanks to her. And uh, thanks for watching and see you all in the next live session. Namaskar. Namaskar.